Last time on Clay at Home. Hi everyone, welcome to another Clay at Home video. Today I'm going to show you how to recycle little scraps of slabs that you might have from other projects. Um, I'm going to be using just a bisque mold that I had made as well as these two yogurt cups. And I'm going to show you how to make like a little bowl as well as a little plate. So I'm just going to cut out all of my circles out of my scrap piece of slab. And I'm going to start with these yogurt cup molds. So I'm just lining the yogurt cup with some plastic to make it easier to retrieve the bowl afterwards. And I'm just going to press. I also like to use my fingers to make like a little crimped design on the, like the inside. Uh, I just think it looks really cute. <laughs> All right, moving on to this press mold, I have a piece of foam here, and I'm just pressing down into the clay and as well as the foam to form that rim. You can also use like a found piece of wood or even another object if you cover it up with a little bit of plastic so it doesn't stick to your clay. And um, yeah, I get creative with it. To clean these guys up, all I'm gonna do is take my sure form and run it around the edge of my plate. An important note about the sure form, if you are using it at home or even at the studio, make sure you're using like leather dry clay, um, just no, no bone dry clay because you do not want to be kicking up a bunch of dust while you're doing this and make sure you get all of those scraps and dispose of them uh, correctly. So like in, in some water or if you have a reclaimed bucket, that will work great. And that's it. I added a spout to one of these little bowls too. I love to use these little bowls for salt or pepper when I'm cooking and I have a vision of also using this one with a spout for some oil or something like that while I'm baking. Uh, an inspection from <laughs> my cat to make sure everything's in working order and that's it. If you have any ideas of how you would use these bowls, please leave a comment and thank you so much for watching.